Hi everybody, this is Beach Cricket, and I did a little hike up on the hill. I'll show you where I hiked from to this point. But isn't it beautiful? It's so pretty here. I'm really enjoying um, the whole outdoor experience in these pines. It's just fantastic. The wind is blowing, so I hope you can hear me. Um, this area is just fantastic because if you've seen in the other videos, um, every day we get to see the sheep herder come through with a huge flock of sheep and listen to them and see all the different varied sizes of them. It's just so cool. I love it. And um, so I enjoy that every day. In the morning they arrive probably about 8 o'clock, 8.30, somewhere in that time frame and uh, go to a watering hole that's over that way. And from there, they graze all day. And then at nighttime, they go back. So it's really fun to see that every day. <laughs> I get to see it twice and it's just, I love it. There's all different sizes. And so it's just really interesting to see the different colors and all the different sizes of them. It's just fun. But anyway, this area is so beautiful. I grew up in the pines in Florida, so this is very nurturing to me in my soul. I love it. It's just fantastic. So, I'm going to show you around. I hope you can hear me. I hope the wind isn't too bad. Okay, stay tuned. I am, um, that I went all the way down there. My bus is right there, that shuttle, babe. And there's a hill all the way down there. It's not really that high, but I did have to puff and puff a bit. <laughs> After all, I am 64. I'm not a young chicken, but I do like to still hike and jog and get out there, and I need to be doing it more. Um, this elevation tends to, uh, you know, it, it makes you catch your breath a little bit more. I'm, I'm still not acclimated to the height. We were, we we're like 7,000 something feet, and um, ever since I've gotten up this high, and that didn't happen to me last summer when I went up to Rocky, uh, you know, Mountain National Park in Colorado. I mean, that was 12,000 feet and it didn't even phase me. But for some reason, it's, uh, it's phasing me this time. So, and it is all my other fellow campers. So, you know, if it was just me, I would be maybe concerned I have some kind of health issue or something. But I am in pretty good shape. But this is the area. It's just gorgeous. I love it. It's just fun to get out here and explore and see all this beauty. They're doing a lot of clearing here, I noticed. And um, I think the sheep herder, the business for the, for the sheep, I believe that they're right down there. That's their area right there. Because there's some equipment and it just looks like it's, uh, you know, some type of endeavor, some kind of farm. And since the sheep are here, I'm just assuming that that's the headquarters. But anyway, give you some more of this beauty. another RV or way down there he's not with our group but uh, he's right on the edge of where the pasture land is for the sheep grazing we had thought about going down there but it's kind of ruddy and just not that really ideal for you know setting up your camp Lots of fun, lots of laughter. There's Shuttle Babe. <laughs> All right, it's a beautiful June day, so it's about 78 degrees with these beautiful, soothing breezes blowing through the pines. It's just ideal. I love it. So, um, just out of curiosity, this morning 
before I got out here and, and was, you know, playing around and doing my little hike, I uh, went and checked a lot of the weather in various places that I've lived. And most of them were in the hundreds and a lot of them were in Florida where I grew up. And that, <laughs> that humidity factor is a whole other experience there that's, that makes it really hotter. So it makes it very uncomfortable. So I am enjoying this weather here in Northern Arizona. I love it. It's just beautiful up here in the pines. I just, I'm just so happy to be here. So that hike was fun. I hope you enjoyed the scenery and everybody wake up and live. Get out there, have adventures. It's your life. Make it happy. All right. Peace, cricket out. Bye.